Hello everyone, today we're going to talk about photosynthesis. This is the process of converting the energy in the sun into energy stored in the bonds of glucose. The supplies needed for photosynthesis are carbon dioxide, water, and the sun's energy. Carbon dioxide enters and oxygen leaves the plant through the pores of the leaf, and water enters by the plant's roots and is stored in the central vacuole to be used for photosynthesis. The portion of the plant cell where photosynthesis occurs is the chloroplast. The thylakoid are the little tiny sacs that contain the green pigment called chlorophyll. The grana is the stack of all of the thylakoids. And the stroma is the fluid that surrounds all of the granas. The first step of photosynthesis is when the sunlight activates the chlorophyll that is located inside the thylakoids of the chloroplast. This becomes excited and it breaks apart the water molecules, releasing oxygen and hydrogen ions. The next step, the hydrogen ions move through the membrane of the thylakoids to the stroma through the electron transport chain. Oxygen is then released to the atmosphere through the pores of the leaf. During this stage of photosynthesis, the electron transport chain uses the hydrogen ions to create NADPH and ATP. These energy molecules fuel the Calvin cycle on the stroma of the chloroplast. In this step of photosynthesis, the Calvin cycle breaks apart the carbon dioxide, uses the hydrogen from the H2O and the carbon and oxygen from CO2 to make glucose, C6H12O6. The leftover oxygen is now released into the atmosphere through the pores of the leaf. Photosynthesis can be divided into two types of reaction. The first, the light-dependent reaction, occurs in the thylakoid and the thylakoid membrane when the chlorophyll splits apart the wall molecules and moves the hydrogen ions through the electron transport chain. The second is the light-independent reaction, and this is the Calvin cycle and the stroma. Photosynthesis as a chemical equation. First, the reactants that react together. 6CO2, 6H2O, or carbon dioxide and water, mixed with the energy of light to produce C6H12O6 glucose and oxygen. The meaning of the term photosynthesis is simply the use of sunlight, photo, to make synthesis glucose. Photosynthesis is considered an endothermic reaction because it takes the energy from the sun and stores it in the bonds of glucose. Well, folks, that's all about photosynthesis today. Stay tuned, and in the next video, we will talk about cellular respiration and ATP.